guys, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new, welcome to my channel. So I get like everyone's doing Christmas videos and Vlogmas and everything that's festive and holiday-ish and... I'm not gonna do that. You know, I don't really feel a need to put out festive content even though Christmas is only like three days away. I don't really care, so... And I know some people were probably expecting that I was gonna do some kind of festive holiday content, but... I'm not. I'm sorry. I get it. I'm terrible. I, I'm, just, I'm just a shitty YouTuber. I but I don't care. So I had some inspiration for this video. I thought about the other day. I don't know why. It just kind of popped in my head. I was watching some YouTube videos and the idea of James Charles facetuning his fans popped into my head. Hi sisters! Ah! And I was kind of like, you know, I kind of want to do that, but I was like, you know, maybe people will get offended if I facetune their photos. Like, I don't really want to get people mad at me for that. So I flipped it and I was like, what if I told my followers to facetune me? Like crazy. Mind blown. I know. So that's exactly what we're going to be doing in today's video. I asked my Instagram followers to facetune whatever photo of me that they want. They could facetune it however they want. They can make it as real or as fake looking as they want. And today I'm just going to show you guys. So we have quite an array of photos. It's definitely something. If you wanted to facetune my photos but didn't get to because you don't follow me, you can follow my Instagram at I'm actually Gia so you don't miss the next time I do this or something where I need your guys' input or your help. Also, if you go down in the description, you're going to see my other social media like my Twitter and my Snapchat, which I post updates all the time. So the first pictures were sent by Duh, It's Sid. And she sent me some pretty interesting things so the first one is probably the most realistic out of all that I've gotten and basically it's the one of me at Brockhampton showing off my outfit and she really bro made me thick she made me slim thick like she made me popping like do y'all see that I'm I'm popping obviously not facing whatsoever clearly not face soon. I'm really built like that. And I think that's like all she did. That's literally all she did. <laughs> wow, we love a slim thick legend. And then this one is so weird. I can tell she took so much time to make this and I thought it was hilarious because it's just the most random shit I have ever seen. So this is a picture I have on my Instagram and it's some $12 macaroons that I got when I was in Miami because I needed an excuse to be in the same restaurant as Justin Bieber. So I bought some $12 macaroons and I posted them on my Instagram. And what she did, she took the thumbnails from my YouTube videos where you can see my face and she edited them into the macaroons. Like literally look at them. Like this one with the, the pink one, that's literally my boy band video. This is from my Instagram video. This is from dyeing my hair purple. This one's from my reacting to my musicals. This one's from my monument video. Like literally, she didn't have to go that hard, but she did. Like she really did. Maybe she snapped. Okay, so this next one is from Tequila. <laughs> this one, this one's just me. This is the real me before the face tune. This is the real. Like, it truly is. I mean, I just got kind of everything just like goes down. But the thing is, I don't just face tune, I also video tune. So what I look like now is in that picture she sent me, which she kind of exposed me doing that. But it's fine. I I'm still popping. You know, my nose just a little bit, it's a little bit longer in real life. And my eyes are a little bit bigger. I like to make them a little smaller. You know, I got my nice high arched eyebrows. And you know, that's the real me. It's the real me. And this is before I got my lip injections, by the way. That's why they seem a little small. But it's okay. We got some work done. It's fine. The next one was sent by Natalie Suarez. And I, I was dying, okay? When I saw this, it was literally like 2 in the morning when I saw this one. And I was literally 
crying, laughing so hard. Are you sure about that? And she called it Mega Mind. I mean, it speaks for itself. It really does. Hey, big hand. Look at this dude. <laughs> Wait till you see the. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> And, I mean, all she did, I'm pretty sure all she did, she just pressed the pinch feature, and I don't know, it, it's really over. Like, my forehead is literally a seven head. It's literally like this. That's my forehead in this. That's, yeah, yeah. Alright, these next two are from Queen Lizzle, or Lizzie, I'm not really sure. And... The first one that she sent me is actually pretty normal. It's a picture I posted on Valentine's Day. And this one's like normally faced. And she just gave me a little more pop on my highlight and on my colors. So nothing super weird or out of the ordinary with that. It's just like a typical thing. This is what I expected to get, okay? This is what I had expected for everyone to do. But y'all are just crackheads. Period. And then she sent me this one, which I was like, all right, the crackhead jumped out. I mean, she gave me the whole fish eye effect. She made me look like a who. A who. Literally, look how small my nose is. My, like, everything's small. And then you see my eyes and they just, like, jump out. I, that, I'm literally a who. But my highlight is blinding. So maybe it kind of, like, cancels it all out, like PEMDAS. So maybe. Okay, this one I thought was absolutely hilarious, and this one, like, describes my personality perfectly. So, Emily Rocco, she sent me this one, and she made it into, like, a Snapchat, and it says, I've been hitting the gym, and she used the little emoji that I use all the time, and it's my picture from me in Mykonos, and she made me slim, uh, slim, 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 do I have a lisp? Slim, thick, she really took me into Hallie Kirk, Father Kells, like, everybody. She really made me into an Instagram thotty. Like, really, really. Waist. Snatched. Hips. Browned. Arm. Broken. This one is sent from Cassidy Scoura. Cassidy, I'm sorry if I said your last name wrong. You and Jamie just have, like, the most difficult last name on the planet. She said, are you ready for my masterpiece? And it's uh, the photo I took on my Mac, uh, on my Mac in photo booth that I posted. And she really did the whole shablam for your girl. We got over here at the face. She gave me that <laughs> crimson chin style face tunage plastic surgery. And then she gave me a little bit Kylie Jenner lips to even out the crimson chin. And then if we go down. <laughs> This part just gets me every time I look at it. It's just so warped when you look at my legs. She really made them thick. Like, she really made me look like I go to the gym, okay? Like, Instagram baddies everywhere are quaking. Like, for real. This literally just has me dead. Like, I, I really... That's the first thing I look at, and it just makes me scream. This next one's from Angel Vomit, with a 5 for the E in Angel. And she sent me this really cute one, and she told me it's Kawai or Kawai. Wait, how do you pronounce Kawai? Okay, I found this on the web for how do you pronounce Kawai. Kawai? Kawai? Huh, interesting. Hmm. I learn more every day from Google. But this one is so cute, but like literally she made me so pale. How did you do that? That's literally, I'm literally like gray. Like I'm gray. And so was my hair. Oh my god, I just noticed my hair. I Like, only thing I noticed was my skin was gray. But honestly, I look so cute. I really do. And I was popping in this picture, so you just made it even more popping. So thank you. Okay, this one was texted to me from my friend Maya. And I thought it was hilarious because nobody so far had sent me one with another person. And then she sent me this one of me with Shawn Mendes. And we look like literal trolls. Like, I look like a troll. I look disgusting. Like, look at my little fucking sperm looking eyebrow. Like, that's literally so funny. And then Shawn reminds me of Happy. Like, that one creepy thing. Not Happy, Smiley. He reminds me of Smiley, but with a face, and it like scares the shit out of me low-key when you stare at it long enough. Mm. 
Legend has it, if you turn off all the lights and say Sean Mendes five times in the mirror, that's what you'll see. No, that's literally terrifying. Um, Maya, this is, this is what I see when I have sleep paralysis. This is what I see at the edge of my bed during sleep paralysis. Okay, and then another one that someone sent to me of me and someone else is from Bless by Perp with two P's at the end. And they said ones of me and Leslie when we were at Pretty Much. So the first one, they kind of like facetune the fuck out of mine. I don't know what happened to my eye. I'm a little low there. She added some blush. See, why does Leslie look normal and then y'all just like decided to like do that to me? I feel a little bit disrespected right now, but... And then, oh my god, this is just like on crack. This whole photo is on crack. This is what you see when you're on acid. Okay, so first of all, me, my lips, how did you even do that? Like, those don't even look like my lips. <laughs> it honestly looks like you just photoshopped something on. Those literally look like Jay-Z's lips. I don't even know. My middle finger is actually that long. And then Leslie's, like, whole bottom lip just kind of, like, got stretched out. I really don't know what happened there. And her middle finger surprisingly looks really normal, so... Oh my god, and the guy in the back, or that was a lady, oh my god, the lady in the back, you gave her a mohawk, I literally stan you. Alright you guys, so that was everything. Let me know which photo you guys thought was the best face tuned. My dog's barking because there's someone he sees out the window. Uh, anyways, let me know which photo you thought was the best. Second of all, I just want to thank everybody that sent me a photo and that contributed to this video. I really love you guys so much. All my Instagram followers, my Twitter followers, my subscribers, all of you. I love you so much, so thank you for supporting me and my crazy, weird ideas. If you guys like this video, make sure you give me a big thumbs up. And also go down and subscribe and hit the little bell button when you're down there. It's going to go when you're subscribed and you'll know when I post every Saturday. All right, that is it. I love all you crazy crackheads so much. I hope you have a fantastic rest of your weekend. I hope you have a fantastic Christmas if you celebrate that. And I will see you guys next year. Oh, wait. Girl, I really just said next year. No, I'm going to see you before the year ends, so don't think we're doing that bullshit. I'm going to see you guys before the year's over, so I will see you next week for the last video of 2018. It's probably not going to be anything special, if I'm being really honest. But, yeah, I'll see you then. So, until then, peace out. Take hold of me. You're flowing through my own light, ecstasy, ecstasy.